Well, hello there, everyone. One next year with another tutorial. Well, it's a remake of one of the last tutorials. The last tutorial I gave you about Sonic GMI it was a bit off. It's Sonic GMI was not the right tool. I had a different tool, but I got I confused Sonic GMI with it, and I thought it was that tool. So this is going to be the real tutorial on how to get my mods and many and many other Sonic Generations mods, almost all of them, to work with this other tool. And it's well, sorry about that. Well, anyway, I don't have it already downloaded on this laptop here, so I'll go ahead and show you where to download it itself. So then, you know, I don't have to pack it up in my downloads anymore. Now, first of all, you can go to Google. Where do you go, Google? Free advertisements. Search on. Okay. So, basically, all you do is you type in Sonic Generations Hacking. That's all you type in. And then I think it's this link you go to. And it should have, yep, right here. It lists all the tools you use to hack. And right here, CPK Ritter. CPK Ritter. I don't think I'm Redder or whatever. I'm not sure I'm pronouncing that right. But CPK Redder. You click on this link here. And uh, it can be any version, I think. Download it. You let it download. My download will work. All right. After it downloads, you go to where it was downloaded. Which would be uh, somewhere here. <laughs> Apparently, I'm blind today. Uh, right here. You extract it. And after extracted, you copy all these files here, not the mods folder, not this. These files right here. You copy them and then paste them into your Sonic Generations folder right here and uh, let's see if I can get it to work copy well, let me back up my files real quick in this case uh, I haven't tried this before but I'm pretty sure it works I haven't tried this particular version before. I the last version I did was like two something. You paste it there. Everything. You run the exe. Now it's gonna ask you. This little program patches the Sonic Generations exe so that CPK Redder DLL is well lo okay loaded automatically each time the game is started. This program can also remove the patch and restore Sonic Generations to the EXE original state. Do you want to continue with this, the patch of Sonic Generations.exe? If you want to mod it. Now, I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure this slows down your game a little bit. Only a little bit because it loads files while playing the game. But I'm not particularly sure when I install this on my other... PC that had Sonic Generations. I was downloading another game at, and, and downloading and installing another game at the moment. So I don't know if that was slowing down my game, but I'm pretty sure it wasn't. But this might slow down your game a little, but not that much. Only a little bit. Like, worth like 3 FPS. But, so, it's fine. You type Y, hit enter. Done. Just like that. Now, you're able to put in this folder here. You put in a folder right here called B named BB. The folder must be named BB, otherwise HUD mods will not work. Like, uh, for instance, uh, someone on one of my other videos asked how to get one of my HUD mods to work. They, I'm not sure what they were, what they were doing wrong or if I did something wrong. I wasn't really sure what was happening. 
but if he he might have been naming the the folder BB3, but the folder needs to be named BB. It cannot be named anything else, or else HUD HUD mods will not work. So you name it BB, and then you can just drop your mods in here. I already have a mod installed, and uh, I already have a mod installed. So yeah, but it needs to be named BB. I'm just making that clear. So now that you've installed this patch, all you gotta do is just run your SonicGenerations.exe. That bubble right there will pop up, and that'll be the mod. And it'll it'll apply your files, and uh, you won't be able to hear me for a second, so I'll stay quiet. But wait, I can speak for a second. So I'll apply your, your mods, and you'll be able to have all the fun you want. It's much easier and stuff. So the last tutorial I did was a mess up. I'll delete the last the the other t song generations tutorial and replace it with this one. So let's see if the game even works. Now, uh, the reason it's not loading right now is because this PC here is actually... A, Sega. It's under the system requirements for Sonic Generations. It doesn't meet it, but it still plays it. So that's why it takes forever to load. Alright, so the game runs. So we know that. That's basically all I gotta show you. There's the tutorial. Enjoy, enjoy your mods. Bye.